Hello everyone, I'm Lazy Graves, and today we're taking a look at Dead's Kislev units, which is a mod that adds a bunch of really cool units for Kislev. They're all very thematic for the faction, with names that I will probably mispronounce, so feel free to correct me. First we got the Kvasniki, which is a hybrid infantry unit, and these crazy Kislevite doesn't dress as if they live in a freezing climate. But they don't need to, because they can warm themselves on enemies that they set on fire, because they got Molotov cocktails that they throw at their enemies at short range that deal significant explosive fire damage to tightly packed infantry units. But they rely on the explosion to deal damage, so they don't do much to single entities. They only have 4 volleys though, so they will have to go into melee eventually, and they are pretty decent in melee combat. They're started kind of like a more offensively minded Cossar, so they can deal some decent damage, but they won't last very long. They also seem to be drinking their cocktails because they have Rampage and Rowdy which gives them leadership and perfect vigor as long as they keep their leadership above wavering. Next we have the Dryoshki and it takes some special kind of crazy to go completely shirtless in the Kislevite climate, especially when you don't have the Kvasniki cocktails to keep you warm. They're a damage dealing infantry unit and they're great damage dealers with good combat stats and bonus versus infantry, but as you might imagine looking at them, they have no armor so they're a glass cannon unit. But they don't mind taking damage since they got death blow that increases their damage once they drop below 20% HP. They also got a new range unit, the Droboviki, which is a shotgun unit with pretty short range but good damage, but since it is a shotgun, it's split over multiple projectiles, so to get the most out of them, they're best used against large units and big blobs of infantry where all projectiles hit. They are a bit strange for a Kislevite unit though, since they don't really work as a hybrid unit, unlike all the other range units they have. Most of their combat stats isn't bad, but they have terrible damage, so they aren't really gonna deal much damage in melee combat. They also got war bears, so if you wanted bear cab without riders, you got it, and they are awesome. They're an anti-infantry war beast, and they got generally good stats and good damage, but they got a fairly low melee attack, but a 20 bonus versus infantry, which they rely heavily on to hit things. So they are an anti-infantry war beast, and they are great at it, but they are very specialized at it, so they aren't very good against things that aren't infantry. And since they are bears, they fit in great with the Kislev motif, and I know some people don't like the amount of bears they have, but I love it, so I'll gladly welcome additional bears with open arms. And finally, we have the Urugun cannon, and I imagine that's just how Kislevites pronounce organ gun, because it's basically an organ gun, but with shorter range, lower damage, and what seems to be less accurate. But it's still an organ gun, so it can deal some pretty good damage. Because even if it's not as good as the dwarf variant, that doesn't mean it's not good, it's just not as good as dwarf artillery. Overall, the units are really fun to use and thematically they're great. They all feel like Kislev units while still filling their own niche in the roster. So if you're interested, I'll put a link to the mod down below. And thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.